Hi, it's Valtus Angel, and it's another Vlog Tuesday, and I figured that I would show you my bookshelf. Um, I have, I had, a, I have a lot of books, and um, since I recently moved, well, I want to say recently, but since I moved, I was really, really excited and happy that I got my bookshelf all nice and situated and I have I have a place for my books instead of them being in boxes like they were in my old apartment so I will show you what they look like now that I have everything all of the books in my uh, my bookshelf we have a beautiful I don't know it's got to be over seven feet tall um, bookshelf that has all of my books in it all my favorite books, all my favorite um, things that I've read over the years and favorite, uh, I don't know, everything, my favorites. <laughs> so I'll start from the top. Um, from the top I have quite a few uh, biographies and uh, memoirs that I liked from certain celebrities. Um, and I thought they were really cool and wanted to keep them. Latoya's book. Um, I have uh, Lonnie Anderson's book, which is a very good uh, read, actually. Diana Ross. Um, I have a couple of books from when I was in school, in high school and college. And um, this is actually, let's see if I can pull it out. This is actually my favorite book. It's helped me to write um, some of the things that I've been writing, especially the web series. So I like this book quite a bit. Um, let's see. There are quite a few um, plays that I love. Um, let's see. My favorite. Uh, let's see. This is my favorite. Macbeth. Love this. I don't know why, I just love it. And then I have Richard III, which is also one of my favorites. And Hamlet. I just love those three in particular. Those three Shakespearean plays. Um, I have a couple of books from <laughs> way back in the day, William Shatner used to write books and they were all um, tech. Uh, like a series of tech books and then these are like this is the tech lords and the tech lab which is awesome um, I I enjoyed his books quite a bit <laughs> no, it's not like the you know Shakespeare of uh, of science fiction but I like like that the next row I have a lot of like it's a mix. It's a mix of like trashy, um, trashy novels. I have a couple of one um, here, Jackie Collins book. A couple. This is another like, you know, silly romance novel that I enjoyed quite a bit. You can see they're quite worn and uh, quite red. And um, I really like these. The only thing I don't have in my collection that I lost over the years is Dune. And I plan on getting that back. Um, and that's, I have a couple of Anne Rice, which I enjoyed. Um, and I have a very old, um, I think I ha I've had this for like over 20 years, maybe more than that. The next row down is um, all my ancient Egyptian books. It's kind of I was just fascinated with the ancient Egyptian world for many, many years. I would say it's been over like 20 years of, of uh, collection. Not, it's not that big of a collection, but it was, it's basically all that I could afford. You know, this is for somebody who's on a budget. Um, <laughs> over the last 20 years, these are the books I collected. Um, this level, these are all, these are all like really huge, large books. They're like oversized. 
Um, and they're all pretty much stuff that I've collected over the years for fashion. When I went to FIT and um, there's some Egyptian books in there that I couldn't fit in the, on the row above. A couple of um, textbooks from classes and stuff like that. The next row down is sort of a mix of religion and like mysticism. So it's, the entire row is all about that. And the bottom shelf is just sort of whatever else. It's, there's really no rhyme or reason to the bottom shelf, but it's just all sort of like books that I needed and I was interested in the topics. The oldest book that I have actually is this book which I had since I was a little girl and I used to always just read this since there's a lot of tales and fables inside and it's pretty beat up as you can see. Um, yellow yellow um, paper obviously the spine is all like broken <laughs> and destroyed that's because this is such an old book but it was um, a fun book when I was growing up when I was little I, I had a, a good transference between words and pictures this is hard when you're when you're switching out of from picture books to to actually see like some really cool um, pictures, kind of helps you to um, get a a grasp of how to use your imagination sometimes. So that's it. That's my little bookshelf tour, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it was kind of fun going through all my books and showing you, you know, what um, kind of goes. I guess when you look at someone's bookshelf, you kind of look into a little bit into their soul a little bit because you get to see um, some of the things that they're interested in. And I hope that you got a better picture of, you know, what who I am and my, my personality from that. Anyway, I will see you in the next video. Bye.